The coroner's office is said to be working to establish exactly when Sinead O'Connor died, after she was found unresponsive at her London home this week. The coroner investigating the death of Sinead O'Connor has said that it's unknown when she died according to the Daily Mail. The 56-year-old singer was found unresponsive in her London flat by police on Wednesday, after they were called to carry out a welfare check. She was later pronounced dead at the scene, and her family released a statement to confirm the tragic news. The London Inner South Coroner's Court told the Daily Mail her death had been referred to them and at this moment the date of death is unknown. In a statement, they continued, no medical cause of death was given. The coroner, therefore, directed an autopsy to be conducted. The results of this may not be available for several weeks. The Met Police are said to be investigating the circumstances surrounding her sudden death to try and create a timeline of events. In a statement on Thursday, they said, police were called at 11.18 a.m. on Wednesday, July 26, to reports of an unresponsive woman at a residential address in the SE24 area. Officers attended, a 56-year-old woman was pronounced dead at the scene. Next of kin have been notified. The death is not being treated as suspicious. A file will be prepared for the coroner, in the days leading up to her death. Sinead had been active on social media, showing fans around her new penthouse apartment in London. In a video posted to Twitter, she showed off her Martin Johnny Cash electroacoustic guitar and announced plans to write more music. She also apologized for the mess, saying, Unfortunately, your kid passing away, it isn't good for one's body or mind. Sinead leaves behind three children, Jake, 34, Royson, 27, and Yeshua Benadio, 16. Her second son Shane died by suicide in 2022.